Hello Cancers, happy birthday. So this is your monthly reading. I'm gonna start with the general messages. All right, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Cancers for July 2022? Balance, universe, you need my cards, purpose, so there's balance, purpose, growth, and success, and regrets, okay? So I feel like you guys are not in this phase. If you was in this phase before, you no longer, okay? Um, I feel like right now you are enjoying your fruits, the fruits of your labor, okay? Because I see things have become very successful for you guys. You feel really balanced. Um, you feel like you're on your ish, okay? You feel like you are pursuing your passion, your purpose. Um, let's just say you're not there yet. I feel like you're going to be there. July is going to be that month to inspire you, okay? And there is a lot of growth. So I feel like you're going to be looking back like a couple days or probably looking back right now at like how far you come from last year to this year, okay? And I feel like a lot of you guys are really proud of yourself. So that's good. Let's look at the other tag. Let's see the last message I'm getting. So universe, give me a three card spread. Universal messages, what messages do you have for cancers for July 2022? Okay, so you guys got occupation, despair. Universe, give me one more card. High honor, general energy, message of concern. Okay, so I got two categories, okay? So for those who feel like they're not where they want to be, um, I feel like the universe wants you to know that you can be. It's not too late. The universe just wants you to get out of the spirit of this energy, okay? Um, because I do see things are moving forward, but you just have to see things are moving forward and seize the opportunities, kind of like carp Dam, you know? Seize the opportunities, move forward, stay consistent, stay motivated, okay? Because I do see things working out for you, but you just got to get out of this energy. Now, for the other category, some of you guys may feel like you're being overworked at the moment, okay? But at the same time, you're kind of feeling like things are changing, like probably there's a change of management or just, you know, how the market is set up. We're in a bear market, there's inflation, there's just a lot of stuff going on and probably you're a little bit worrying, okay? Let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, clarify message of concern. Okay, so there's official person, universe clarify official person, lovers. Okay, some of you guys, hmm, some of you guys are a little bit not trust, like you're not trusting of your person. You feel like something's going to come out about them. Universe clarify lovers, mature man and great fortune. Okay, or some of you guys are worried about them like when it comes to their occupation okay that's not gonna apply to a lot of people universe clarify despair sudden wealth yeah so universe clarify occupation wealthy man so some of you guys have gemini gemini had a strong message of finances as well so what i'm trying to say is like not to get too caught up with the news and what's going on? <laughs> it's not just the news. It's, you see inflation everywhere. Um, not to get too caught up with that. Just know that there is the other side. There is room to grow. There's uh, there's ways to get opportunities, even though the market's looking weird and crazy. <laughs> okay, um, just just kind of keep seeing things in a half full uh, mentality, so you can see those other opportunities, and you don't get lost in the sauce of what's going on. Okay. That's what I'm seeing. Um, some of you guys are going to be meeting someone who's actually very knowledgeable and who's going to be helping you out when it comes to finances as well, too. That's what I'm getting. So let's look at the tarot. A lot about money. <laughs> so let's see if there's anything about love with the tarot. All
Okay, so universe, give me a five card spread. What messages do you have for cancers for the rest of its month? I said for the rest of this month, for <laughs> July. Let's see. Okay, so Universe, give me a five card spread. Universe, what messages do you have for Cancers for July 2022? Universe, give me four more cards. Universe, give me three more cards. Universe, give me two more cards. What messages do you have for Cancers for July 2022? Universe, give me one more card. Okay, hold on you guys, um, in the future. Let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, clarify three of pentacles. So there is the magician, universe clarify magician, nine of pentacles in the verse. Yeah, some of you guys are in a relationship, okay? You manifested this relationship. Probably there is some friends or family members that are trying to talk you out of being this and being in this relationship. Universe, clarify the Knight of Swords in reverse and the Hermit in reverse. The Lovers in reverse. Universe, clarify the Lovers in reverse. Ten of Wands. Okay. Yeah, I feel like past, it could be like friends or family members or it could be like lovers, ex-lovers who trying to say no, the person that you're with is not the one and you should be with them. Okay, that's what I'm getting. Universe, clarify Five of Swords in reverse. The song that I'm getting is a classic song, Akon. Nobody wants to see us together. Okay. Akon. I forgot what sign is he. What sign is he? I believe he's Aquarius. Okay. Some of you guys are done with Aquarius and look, we got Aquarius here. The so universe clarify star. Universe clarify star. Eight of Wands in the verse. Okay. Yeah. So probably you guys either give someone from the past a chance or you just, you, you're feeling someone, you know, you... You, you just want to connect with them. However, people that you know is trying to talk you out of being with this person. It could be because they have a reputation, okay? Or it could be like you just got a relationship, so they probably think, oh, you shouldn't be in a relationship, okay? But I feel like you're just doing things by your own rules, not what other people are trying to project on you. Universe, clarify the fool. Ace of Cups and the Queen of Wands. Yeah, so I feel like you guys are... In, in love or about to be in love okay you're about to fall in love okay now it's not really t it's not really telling me the outcome okay and when it's a new love type of relationship it's kind of good that it doesn't tell the outcome because sometimes the tarot will be it'd be too much it'd be too 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 honest in a sense where you just you just like this person everything is good but it's going too much in the far future where you think about it too much okay <laughs> So I feel like right now, you guys are just enjoying the present. If it works out, it works out. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I think that's your mentality, okay? Because um, here's not even talking about the outcome, like what's going to really happen. It's just saying that you guys are just enjoying the present. People are trying to give you some advice, but it's like you feel like it's not warranted, okay? Universe, clarify the page of wands. Universe, clarify the page of wands. The tower in reverse. Universe, clarify the tower in reverse. Eight of Swords. Universe clarify the Page of Cups. King of Wands in reverse. Universe clarify the King of Wands in reverse. Universe clarify the King of Wands in reverse. The Judgment and Three of Cups. Yeah, so you got friends and family member who's trying to give you some pointers, right? And you also got a lover, an ex-lover, who's trying to say, no, don't be with this person, be with me. <laughs> Okay, but I feel like right now you enjoying your person. You feel like you guys are meant to be. Okay. Okay, so let's see here. The signs that might be significant could be an Aries, a Scorpio, or a Virgo. Okay. Okay, let's look at the other deck. Okay, universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Cancer? Such shares might be significant for you guys too. Crown chakra, disconnect, and boredom. Okay, 
And then there is um, Six of Wands. Moving on, Six of Swords. Okay. Um, the Eight of, I mean, Three of Wands. And then the Shadow. Jenna Energy is patience and planning. Okay. Yeah. So some of you guys have been single for a while. Okay. And you just want to have fun. It's the summer. Okay. Um, but I just see this as more than just a fooling. I feel like this is more so a relationship that's being presented and you enjoying this person and you like in their vibes. So let's see what else I'm getting for you guys. Ah, my mouth broke. So let's see. <laughs> okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for cancer? So there's Messiah, Vampire, and Sabotager. Universe, give me one more card. Shapeshifter and Beggar. Universe, clarify Beggar. Goddess and Athlete. Okay, this is what I'm getting here. I feel like... Hmm, I feel like what's going on... Some of you guys are viewing these people that's giving you this... Their pointers or their two cents or advice. You may feel like they're haters, okay? <laughs> you may feel like these are people that are... Their opinions are not really valid. Um, probably you feel like they're not... They're not even like... Like they're not even in a healthy relationship. So you feel like their opinion's not valid. Okay, that's what I'm getting here. Now, another way this can go is probably the the person that you are dealing with, they do have another side to them, okay? So I feel like what I'm trying to say is have that full energy, you know, give love a chance, but at the same time, really get to know this person to see if this is someone that you can trust, okay? That's what I'm seeing as well. Okay, so let's see here. Okay, so Unifies, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for cancers? So big happy changes, no need to worry. Another song I'm getting is another classic. Shantae got a man. <laughs> okay, and yeah, she's a Aquarius too. Shantae is Aquarius, so. So Aquarius, it might be significant for you guys, okay? And then reconsider. And success, okay? Jenna energy is let go. Universe clarify, let go. Choose a new direction and remain positive. Yeah, so you probably met this person when you let go of all your access and this person comes through, okay? So. Okay, so universe, give me a two card spread what messages do you have for cancers okay so in the flow and inner wakefulness jenna energy is being with discomfort okay also another message i'm getting is like um if you know you have colupancy issues don't rush into being a relationship so certain cycles and certain lessons don't be repeated okay from these three cards so being with discomfort at times of discomfort, I encourage to seek my soul essence, which is clear, pure, and luminous. So, yeah, if you know you have either you attract codependent people or sometimes you may be codependent, I just want you to really assess and see if this can repeat again, okay? And then end the flow. When I'm in the flow, magic happens. And then there is an awakeness. I'm completely awake and tuned into my truth, clarity, and inner wisdom, Okay. So I feel like you guys are trusting your own intuition as well and trusting your own self too, okay? So that's the reading that I have for you, Cancers. Happy birthday. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a personal reading with me at queenfittertarot at gmail.com.